Well, after four attempts visiting Berlin, I'm finally here, the Brandenburg Gate. And like most monuments, it looks spectacular in person. Okay, let's get across this street here, walk through it. I feel like there should be a drum roll or something. I gotta tell you guys though, with all these con construction stanchions, <laughs> it reminds me of the wall. <laughs> wow. See some of the damage in the war. Wow. Well, here we go. I'm passing under the Brandenburg Gate, just like Adolf Hitler did. <laughs> wow. <sighs> and comes out on the Unter den Linden, under the linden trees. This is another great boulevard. Now, French Embassy. Now that's where the French Embassy has always been. Before the war, during the war, when it was abandoned, and after the war. But when it was there, that was the French Embassy in East Berlin. This is the American Embassy. Probably the two most important countries of Germany, France and the United States. <clears throat> now this is the American Embassy. When, uh, when this was East Berlin, the capital of East Germany, the American Embassy was, was down here, always on the left. And the American Embassy for West Germany was in Bonn. Well, look at this bike traffic. Now here's one of the things I always wanted to see, right here. This is the Hotel Adlon. This is where Hitler's cronies hung out. Now Hitler uh, didn't go here a lot because he, he wasn't the partying type. But people like Goebbels and Goring uh, and the Nazi bigwigs were all here because this was the place to be seen. I can just see that fat ass Goering and that Gimp Goebbels back slapping and grinning and laughing. This is an art museum. I can't remember, I can't remember what was here when it was East Berlin. Because the American Embassy wasn't here and this wasn't here. But the Adlon Hotel was here. But what happened with it was, uh, it survived the war, or it survived the bombing, but when the Russians invaded, uh, they trashed the place and caused a fire that burned it to the ground. And it wasn't rebuilt until the wall came down. This is called the uh, Adlon Kapinski now, uh, the man who bought it. Typical, fantastic European hotel. We're on the Unter den Linden. Adlon Kapinski. Fantastic hotel.
now when this one is when this was East Berlin, this is as far as you could get up to Unter den Linden. You couldn't get to the Brandenburg Gate. The Adlon Hotel was trashed, and this was part of no man's land right here. And that day I came over here, I came over here uh, to have lunch in a restaurant. And uh, they took me for an obvious Westerner, and man, was I, <laughs> was I spied upon. <laughs> I felt like James Bond. But let me take you up here where I think the American Embassy was. It was down here somewhere on the left. Boy, what a great town, guys. You figure after all that shit from the war and the wall, boy, it's really become something great. Boy, I don't have to tell you what this is. It's in all blocked off. Gee, I wonder why. This is the this is the Russian embassy on the right here. I remember coming over here when it was the Soviet embassy. I guess they don't want anybody throwing rocks at the embassy, forcing people to walk in the street around it. But I was able to walk up right to the gate when it was East Berlin and they had a couple of uh, Stasi right there checking me out. Boy, it's broke off all the way down here. Ah, fuck it, I'm gonna cross the street here. Goddamn Russians. Even in Berlin, they kind of make it hard on you. Let me cross the street here, guys. Now, obviously, this looks a lot prettier in the uh, in the summertime. And these linden trees are finally growing back. You know, they were all blown to hell. So these are, what, as old as the... Uh, I don't remember them being here in 84. Probably as old as the wall came down. Okay, guys, this is it. This was the street that the American Embassy was on, and where they have all that scaffolding there, that was the American Embassy in East, in East Berlin, East Germany. Oh, the Aeroflot office. Gee, it's all closed. I wonder why.
Well, now that I'm ready, <laughs> I know the camera was running. Uh, mission accomplished, guys. I came to see the Vandenberg Gate and I finally saw it. Now, the only thing I need to do is go back to that bar salon and hang out until I leave. Reserve tomorrow. Okay, see you later.